nice to uh, make this presentation to all of you and hopefully to be as much interested as the ones that they were before. So we're Intelid, a company that would be able and would like to rocket your energy savings. And I mean that to be now, right now. From the beautiful city of Thessaloniki, where I stay for the pleasant time, and from our company that is based in Athens, I will present you CBEMS, which is a cloud-based software as a service tool for building energy management systems. Now we have a big uh, problem globally, as you know, energy price, energy scarcity, not only European Union, but globally, but this number one sector is buildings, 40% is consumed. And this is based mainly on the age back and lighting, which is 70%, but even more, this corresponds 36% of CO2 emission that contradicts with all the regulation of EU and not only. There is more than 220 million energy inefficient buildings. And so there is a big amount of money that European give, Union is giving to, to go on a PPC part, a public partnership. Now, what we as a company present is A, a 25% lower installation because of the fact that we are making use of cloud technology, 40% energy savings because of our advanced artificial intelligence algorithms, and even more, we have a tool for being able to calculate the CO2 emissions calculator while completing six of the different uh, uh, United Nations objectives, three, seven, nine, 11, 12, and 13, as you can see here. We do offer a solution, an end-to-end -end one, so from the beginning till the end, without having the customer to be uh, worried for anything, we take care of everything. This is in just in a very few words, uh, the CO2 emission calculators for buildings, for any, for any building in any country in the European Union and out only, so that it can become as an energy policy tool for building managers, owners, and companies. So our value proposition is the fact that we are having a first cloud-based BEMS unified under, under a unique Internet of Things platform, which is powered by AI, which is self-adjusting this AI wireless. It is a remote control of multi-zonal HVAC for any kind, size, and complexity of the building, which is a very user-friendly the platform and monitor and control multiple buildings all time long. The market is expanding and it is supposed to become, it is suggested to become actually 20 billion in 2028 with an annual increase presently 12.4%. The sum right now that our company operates is 200 million, the sum in European Union 1.4 and the time 6.5. We are looking forward to capture 0 0.25 of the time in 2027. Now, some of the risks that might be the commercialization of such a smart BMs, which is a high risk endeavor, while there might be uh, presently some uh, existing large players and require significant funding support. That's also our, my presentation here. Uh, while at the same time, it might be insufficient and poorly designed sales and marketing process. There is a competition, but the fact that we do have all this in combination give us, as you can see here from this chart, the advance directly, which is only software as a service companies and indirectly companies that they have same climate as we have, but no such. Our business model is uh, based on a, a, it's a B2B, which is on a license fee plus a hardware price if it is needed, as well as the energy savings on billing. And you can see here in two different categories, so that's what we got the final revenue. Our clients are building owners directly or indirectly, which is the most of the time BEMS consultant, system integrators, ESCOs, and municipalities, which is why we have B2G. Now, we are in the process right now, we have already three strategic partners and uh, large players like at and in the United States that we collaborate, NG, Public Power Corporation, NVM in Hungary. While our early market traction has been already for two years, eight pilots, seven out of them became clients. Now we do have 14 clients, 30 buildings, 20 public, 10 private in four countries with a total of 30,000 square meters. And we have also in the pipeline a number of letter signs by the different municipalities, companies, and so on, as well as collaboration with major companies, as you can see here, like AT&T, Deloitte, the Salt, and so on. Now we are looking for 900K to be able to have it for the seed round and to grow in these 12 months. And this percentage goes mostly on the personnel and less on the marketing, which is very important. So to be able to establish ourselves in these four countries and expand further on while we are going to looking to have 
a positive EBITDA, as you can see here, 46.5 million in four and a half years, but we are looking for an exit. A very experienced team for myself and the rest of the people, as, as well as with the people and the investors and mentors that they make and complement our company very, very well. So we have been able to have a number of different collaborations with different kinds of uh, companies and research institutions and uh, the various industrial partners. And again, we're looking for 900K, so to be able in these 12 months or less to have a product market feels, no sales on the marketing, establish our products and services in at least these four EU countries and to expand further on while we are looking for strategic partnerships with medium large companies in the teleco, construction, hotel, ESCO under a license agreement, so to become afterwards and go ahead on a seed round. A, more than 5 million. Thank you very much. Looking forward for your questions.